before I put myself in danger and venture out into the into the dangerous wilds tomorrow, what I'm going to do first is use a, a crash test dummy of sorts, an experimental substitution, so that I can figure out how these predators are going to approach, what specific areas they might focus on first, and determine what type of combination of uh, food bait we should use to get them to come out. We're in the middle of a very bad storm. They will not come out during that storm. However, tomorrow when it clears, they will be very hungry. So what I'm going to do is utilize the dummy that we have set up and I have a, I don't want to say domesticated, uh, but I have a specimen that is, you can say tame, but is still a wild animal. She has been hand reared since be, after being born, but still has those predatory instincts and we have to be careful. Okay, so now we're ready. This has been sitting for a couple of minutes and now it's a nice consistency. It smells really good. It should do the trick to lure them in. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to bring in uh, my the test dummy that I put together. And uh, what I did was I created a protective suit for it so that I may be able to see specifically where uh, the animals go after. And in return, I have to make sure that I am protected accordingly. Okay, this is the result after approximately five minutes of free feeding. Uh, definitely going to have to make sure to protect my arms, uh, protect my legs, protect my face. Uh, looks like also uh, my abdominal area as well. Still